electric vehicles are becoming more and more popular these days. And one of the essential elements of this automotive revolution is the battery. The battery used in electric vehicles has five main component parts. The module, the electrical system, the battery management system, the thermal management system, and the structural parts. So how do we build a state-of-the-art electric vehicle battery? Let's visit the Syke Motor Battery Plant to find out. This industry-leading factory, a joint venture between Syke Motor and CATL, can produce more than 300,000 electric vehicle batteries per year to the highest European standards. The production line uses automated guided vehicles as part of its high-tech manufacturing execution system. A high level of automation ensures that the batteries are constructed with consistency and high quality. Automation also enables processes to be completed efficiently and quickly. The casing is designed to be strong but lightweight, enabling the battery pack design to be slim and high density. Next. The coolant hose, cold plate, and thermal pad are combined into the thermal management system. This helps to keep the battery at the optimum operating temperature. The battery modules are stored in an automatically managed warehouse. They're delivered through air logistics automatically and accurately, exactly when needed. Robots are used to place the modules into the casing with great precision. Bolts are automatically tightened by the robots. For the next step, the air tightness of the water cooling system is confirmed. After that, it's time to install the high and low voltage wiring harness. The low voltage line connects the battery management unit, BMU, to the battery monitoring unit, CMU. Before moving to the next step, it's a must to ensure the safety of using high voltage electricity. Adding flame retardant insulation further reduces the risk of overheating, further improving the battery operation and safety. After the installation of the cover by the operator, it's automatically tightened by the robots. An air tightness test ensures that the battery pack is dustproof and waterproof to IP67. The EOL offline test performs static and dynamic detection on the state of each cell in the battery pack. Next, the automotive battery is transported to the warehouse through the air logistics line. Then, after a final visual inspection, it's packaged into storage. A safe, reliable and high-quality automotive battery pack is ready to be used.